a video doing the smushing technique so this is my first video so you must be patient with me right let's get some ink old olive scribble it onto the mat a porous mat then get your spritzer make sure that you don't screw it upwards into your face screw it down from a height then take some acetate and make sure you write acetate on there because when you look for it you can't find it oh gosh right. take the acetate don't lay it down you'll get all edges try and keep it curly Oh, I think I've got some red on there. I'll well, soon find out. Bring your cardstock. Lay it down. Still holding. And smush it with your fingers. Like a smush. Pretty pattern. Take it again to your old olive. Bounce it around a bit a lot of water on there, you don't want a lot of water move that across there another pretty pattern voila right, let's get some red on there oops there we go I want a bit dry and I want this a little bit dry so if I turn it over Squish it around. It's dry enough for the red to go on now. So let's wipe away all the green. I don't want it to. I want it to be dry because I don't want it to go a muddy colour when they're mixed together. Because that's not the effect I want. So once again, check that you've got your spritzer nozzle around the right way. You should get an eyeful. Just a small piece. Bounce it up and down against the ink so we get nice patterns. It's not a bad pattern. Smush it around. There we go. Another pretty one. There we go. Lovely Christmas colours. I'm on a secret mission after I do this, so you might see this again somewhere else. There we go. Move that out of the way. Move that out of the way. Turn it upside down because you want it all dry. Not in the wet patch. There we go. Pretty smushing. And it looks lovely when you cut out shapes like butterflies. There we go. Thank you.